Legend of Total War here with part 10 of my uh, Call of Warhammer beginning of the end times let's play campaign as uh, the Reichland. Right, so previously we um, defeated uh, Taylor Backland. They're completely gone when we took to Krugenheim. Uh, Talibheim is under siege though. I suppose there's a very slim chance I might be able to defend against that. Although it's Unlikely. We'll see what happens. It doesn't matter. Now, if we take Nuln, it's totally worth losing um, Talibheim. All right, let's uh, let's do that because we've certainly got a big enough army. Let's just leave behind. Can we recruit anything here? Yeah, we'll just leave recruits behind instead. That way, I can take the whole army. Let's uh, reorganize firstly. Our advance must continue. And then the archers. Where's the other one? No, oh, right next to him. We stand ready to fight. Form up in advance. It shall be done. Victory or death. March on. As you command, my lord. Advance in good mm. order. We shall not fight. Just realised that they could have cannon towers, but since they've got enough, uh, well, sorry, since we, they've got very few troops in there, it's unlikely they'll activate them. There will be no retreat. Only glory. I shall storm the stronghold. Death will follow me. All right, so. I think we'll have enough ammunition to knock down a section of wall with the cannons we've got. Yeah, I think so. Just get a little bit closer. Alright. Oh. It's activated, but I don't see the cannon towers activated, so that's good. Alright, actually we need to get a bit... No, no, we can attack from there. Now let's get a bit closer. Because I really don't want to miss. Actually, now that I think about it, I should probably aim for the gate. It'll cost a lot less to uh, to repair. Because if you look back at um, Wissenland, it cost a lot to repair that wall. It doesn't actually cost anything to repair gates. Now, what are we up against here? Is it two lots of cavalry? Some pistoliers. Okay. If we just sent like a bunch of spearmen, that should do it. I mean, who gives a fuck about the spearmen? Easily replaceable units. And this is what they're for. Um, but that being said, you know, we do have mortars. Okay, so I want to bring the spearmen up to here to protect the mortars as we come inside. Oh shit. Okay, you can take on the pistoliers, why don't you go do that right now? Get, get them the fuck out of here. Just don't die in the process. Good, you at the back. That's what we want to see. It's kind of good to see they're fighting to the death. Alright, excellent work. Let's 
get to there, and we'll just try and hold that going. Why the f okay, there we go. Oh, come on, what the fuck's wrong with you now? I guess you just need to give it a moment for them to activate. There we go. So yeah. Since we've got the ammunition, might as well use it. Let's just see how many of them we can bomb. Hopefully they just sit there and take it like a bitch. Because even though we're going to send in spearmen against them, every single one of them that we might kill could end up saving 10 of my guys. Which means we've just saved a whole of, hell of a lot of them by bombing these guys. And you have got to love the fucking oh shit uh, the uh, the mortars. Come on, don't let them get away. There we go. Got them surrounded, and we're out of here. Remember me in the bleak lands of Moor. Pray Sigma, victory is yours. Pray Sigma, victory is yours. All right, good. So we've now taken Nuln. How much movement do we have left? Not enough to do anything else. Um, Wissenberg itself, that would be good to take. It's only a minor settlement. But hopefully we've deprived them of a lot of the- Oh wow, look at this. Hopefully we've deprived them of, um, their artillery. I'd really like to try some of these out. I've got no space in my recruitment list though, so if I start recruiting them, I'll need to, like, send some of these guys back. Like, I definitely want them though. See, that's, actually, that Hellblast of Oligon's very expensive. But generally speaking, in this game, the expensive units, they are kind of worth it. I don't know if they're going to be better than the mortars, though. At some point, I'll get them. It's just right now, let's, let's just leave it be. Alright, now, I'd, uh, we can't quite get to Hem, Hermdorf. Should be able to beat them fairly easily. But what about getting back to Talibheim? Yeah, it's all whatever. It's not that important right now. There will be no respite while one foe draws breath. We shall make our stand. Our cause is Okay, Cole, you're responsible for bringing these guys back here, and with this, we can certainly keep marching. Alright, that's looking good. How are we going for money? Making about 15,000 a turn. Nuln certainly is uh, contributing to that. So what's this? West Averland. Who are we at war with? Okay, enemies. I've got quite a few. Alright, we have uh, Chaos Undivided, Warriors of Corn, Cinch, Nurgle, Slanesh, Chaos Dwarves, Skaven, Orcs, Night Goblins, Vampire Counts, Bretonia, Wissenland, Sterland, Hockland. Okay, so Everland is not included in that. Let 
I'll tell you what, the mortars would be good for that. Alright, the thing is, I've got to leave someone behind here. I guess I could leave the flagellants. No battle is ever fought in vain, for all life is merely death postponed. We stand ready to fight. Your mother must share them now. Okay, if we get over to here, we should be okay. We shall route the get there next turn. Okay, I might be able to pick up some troops from Kemperbad. No, I can't. Why is there nothing to recruit here? Some spies will be good. Can I get them from here though? Yes, I can. Okay, awesome. Get myself a few of those. Uh, three. I don't think I need three. Maybe. Maybe a spy at Altdorf would be a good thing. Where to, sire? With discretion, sire. Of course, sire. Good. When we've got artillery in the army, we should try and aim to hit from city to city, because that's when we've got the advantage. Okay. We've almost made it down here. No one seems to be there at the I'll moment. So that's, that's a considerable amount of money. It's, it's not an option. Then again, these are these are really low rank um, merchants. So for them to even make any money at all, I guess, is quite quite good. All right, let's let's see. Let's let's try and build up this a little bit. If I build this, it goes from it doesn't really make a hell of a lot of money off that. Still do it anyway. Maybe we'll just increase the taxes, whatever. We've got a very large army here. Well, half an army. I'll send someone to go deal with that eventually. Maybe Carl Franz can go pick it up later. We'll see. Let's move on. Shall make a stand here. Okay, so no one's under siege. Of course, we need to lift that. It's not a big deal. Let's have a look at how we're going. So overall, the orcs and goblins are considered the strongest. We have 26% of their strength. The Skaven, are, well, Skaven's considered the, the best. I'm going to start off with a lot of shit. Ah, fuck the Skaven. They recruited some archers, the motherfuckers. Oh look, they lifted the siege of Talipheim. It's no longer under siege. It's a good opportunity to uh, see. That's that's how much it costs to repair one section of wall. Who's Hockland spy? Empire great cannons would be good if we were on the attack, not for the defense. All right, let's take. We should be able to just bomb pretty much the entire army with our mortars. The enemy will pay in blood. At least I hope so. Really impressed with the artwork in between like battles. Ah, fuck me sideways, making a mess of it already. Okay, if I'm lucky, I might have been able to use the cannons to hit them. Guess we'll see. 
Oh, those Empire Archers, are they, they going to shoot? No. Okay, good. Let's just see what happens. They might go into the town square altogether. That'd be perfect. Aim for them now, anyway. I think the, uh, getting rid of the Beastmen would be a better idea. Because they'd be the strongest. Yeah, very nice. So we've already killed 7%. That's good. What are these? Centigores. Yeah. Oh, shit. Shit, shit, shit. Stop, stop, stop. Slow down, slow down, stop. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Drop that. Drop it. Drop it. Fuck. Alright, you guys. Go kill them. Good thing they were dicking around trying to get out. <laughs> Look at these fucking weird looking things, like... They just, they couldn't quite make it look right. I mean, I'm not complaining, but... I think they did an amazing job to even get Centigors on. How the fuck did they even do this? It's just, it's just weird because the, the game was not originally supposed to support a unit like that. Don't let him in. Ah, oh, let him in. Bitch. Oh well. They didn't do any damage. It's all good. Continue the bombings. Centigors want to play again. No big deal. Alright, I want you to blow up in this if you wouldn't mind. Good. So good, you've already killed half of them. That's great. Bomb them as well. Yeah, you really want to get rid of those beastie gores. You'd actually think the uh, the cannons would have higher range than the mortars. I don't know. Maybe not. Well, might as well just use up the last of this ammo. So they did pretty well, they killed 62% of the army. But still, Beastigors are very strong, I could be careful. Might be a good idea to break another section open. If we can hit the uh, Beastigors from... No, don't do that. From multiple angles. With the cavalry, that would be ideal. If they're going back, shoot them. Hit with explosive rounds. Very inaccurate, but we're still getting a few hits in. Is that no big deal? Um, let's see if I can shoot him a little bit.
Cool. Let's get in there and just smash him. Oh, fuck, they're going back. No, that's not good. Don't go back. I can't smash you from there. Oh, just when I decided to make the attack. Um, Alright, stop. Yeah, you stop. Come over back over here. Because I really want to try and do this without taking too many casualties. I mean, it's only fucking rebels. Um, and it's not like I've got any assault troops. I've got no no melee infantry. I've had to leave them all behind. That's why we got to get back to Reichland. Pick up some more troops. You come around the side there. If we hit them from both sides, surely we can kill the beast of gores. I'm, I think they've got multiple hit points. Yeah. Alright, let's just let's just hope our guys don't die. Okay, why should flood the back of them here? Hang on, how are you guys going? You're not right in the front, are you? No, you're okay. And you are okay as well. Good. Seems to be going well so far. And then hit those beastie ghouls in the rear. And we got them. Ghouls don't count for shit. Very good. Should we sack it or Victory not? Yeah, sack it. Oh man, it fucking ruined the settlement. I should have occupied it. Oh well. So, we were with four units of Altdorf's Company of Honor at my capital. Well, that's good. I didn't even. That's pretty good. Some some halberdiers, I think. Because these guys, they need some fucking troops. Okay, we can get back to Kemperbad. No Alright, just leave behind Empire back. Crossbowman. Get to here, build a watchtower. Our orders are clear. I very rarely leave large garrisons around anywhere. Yep, get back to Kemperbird. And I'll and so must I. bring these guys in. Alright, leave the all of them. We're gonna need we some troops provide. here. What else can we recruit? Those will be useful for someone. Probably I'll give them to Carl Franz when he gets around over here. What are your I hate to leave Altdorf undefended, but I really need soldiers us. over here. Step out smartly, lads. Or I should say Step poorly defended. Sigma, grant us men of the Empire! Advance! So just keep recruiting more troops. Oh, we've still got this to do. Mm, I've already had two battles. I'm not sure if I want to do another one right now. The gods have granted this day to earn our glory. Right, yeah. Okay, now I want you to come down this way. I was hoping they'd have a lot more movement, but it seems like just Carl Franz has heaps. Oh no, he's just got the same man as any other uh, cavalry unit. There is bloody work to be done this day. Alright, I need to know what's going on around here. Of course. Alright, Castle Bastone has got What about Gisoro over here? Where to, sire? Approaching quietly. With discretion, sire. Tomorrow's hmm. journey. Okay, what if I was to leave behind just this loser here? And if 
you could get made up with them up here. It's alright, it'll be fine because I'm recruiting a few more troops there. And don't forget about the agents. One of them has got a heap of movement, it seems. Yeah, 25% extra movement. Holy shit. Okay, get over here. Alright, so we got the Green Knight. He's an heir. Or the heir. Yeah, yeah, just a row seems like a good place to hit. If we can get in there. That's fairly close to right. Uh, we have to come down here a bit more. We shall wrap the gods have granted this okay, day. These guys will meet up soon. Glory. They've left this army here. I don't know what they want to do with that, but once we destroy Bretonia, it'll just disappear. We don't have to hold on to forts, it's not that big of a deal. I need to sell you out and beat this, but I'm just worried it will crash. For the Empire! So they've got some cannons as well. Look, better safe than sorry, we'll do it next time. Okay guys, so that's the end of this episode, so like and subscribe, part 11 is next, and don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time, fuckers.